supporters of Juma Rousseffi have been celebrating in Brazil. The 62-year-old career civil servant will be the country's next president, the first woman to hold the office in Latin America's biggest nation. According to Brazil's electoral court, leftist Rousseff won Sunday's runoff easily, picking up nearly 56 percent of the vote to less than 45 percent for her centrist rival, José Serra. Rousseff said she was happy with her win. It is a huge joy to be here today. Millions of Brazilians trusted me in a mission, perhaps the most important of my life. It's beyond me. It is proof of how advanced our democracy has become, because for the first time ever, a woman will lead in Brazil. Rousseff's victory was thanks to the wholehearted backing of the enormously popular outgoing president, Luis Inácio Lula da Silva, who campaigned with her tirelessly. She said it would be a challenge to succeed him, but she felt confident she could honor his legacy. The joy I feel at my victory is mingled with feelings about his departure. I know that a leader like Lula will never be away from his people, away from us. A former Marxist guerrilla, Rousseff had been jailed and tortured in the early 1970s for fighting against Brazil's dictatorship. She was energy minister and chief of staff under Silva. But Rousseff has never held elective office before, although she's known as a demanding and skilled manager. Still, her supporters say they're confident she'll keep the country moving in the right direction. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.